hi hello welcome to our channel learn more math uh, today we are going to solve a problem from exercise 7.3 uh, this is fifth problem uh, see here what he is asking find the area of the triangle formed by the points 2 comma 3 comma 6 comma 3 and 2 comma 6 by using heron's formula so here we have to use heron's formula to find the area of the triangle so let the given points be a 2 comma 3 b 6 comma 3 and c 2 comma 6 so see here let it is triangle abc so now here it is a 2 comma 3 b 6 comma 3 and c 2 comma 6 so what is heron's formula heron's formula area of the triangle is equal to square root of s into s minus a into s minus b into s minus c where s equal to a plus b plus c by 2 so how can we get a b c so here a is nothing but the distance between b and c so b is nothing but the distance between a and c c is the distance between a and b so by using distance formula we have to find uh, so a b c so then after we have to substitute in the formula so here a is equal to distance between b and c so what is the distance formula square root of x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square so see here square root of x2 minus x1 whole square so this is x1 y1 it is x2 y2 x2 minus x1 whole square is 2 minus 6 whole square so it is a 2 minus 6 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square is 6 minus 3 whole square 6 minus 3 whole square so just we have to simplify see here what we get 2 minus 6 is minus 4 minus 4 whole square is plus 16 plus 6 minus 3 is 3 3 square is 9 square root of 16 plus 9 is square root 25 square root 25 is equal to 5 units this is a length of a bc or a is equal to 5 units so next b is equal to so b is equal to distance between a and c so next we have to find b is equal to b is equal to distance between a and c so a 2 comma 3 c 2 comma 6 so it is x1 y1 it is x2 y2 so x2 minus x1 whole square is 2 minus 2 whole square so it is a 2 minus 2 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square is 6 minus 3 whole square 6 minus 3 whole square so is equal to so 2 minus 2 is 0 0 square is 0 so here 6 minus 3 is 3 so here it is 0 plus 3 square is 9 square root of 0 plus 9 is 9 so square root of 0 plus 9 is 9 so see once again square root of 2 minus 2 is 0 0 square is 0 6 minus 3 is 3 3 square is 9 square root of 0 plus 9 is 9 square root of 9 is 3 so 3 units so b is equal to 3 units so next we have to find the length of a a b it is a c so c is equal to distance between a and b so it is distance between c is equal to distance between a and b so a 2 comma 3 b 6 comma 3 so now it is x1 y1 it is x2 y2 square root of x2 minus x1 whole square is 6 minus 2 whole square 6 minus 2 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square is 3 minus 3 whole square 3 minus 3 whole square so see here what we get 6 minus 2 is 4 4 square is 16 plus 3 minus 3 is 0 0 square is 0 again so square root of 16 plus 0 is 16 square root of 16 plus 0 is square root of 16 so square root 16 is 4 units so now we have abc values 
so now we have to find uh, uh, area of triangle so area of triangle heron's formula So this is the formula we have to use to find the area of the triangle. So Heron's formula area of triangle is equal to square root of S into S minus A into S minus B into S minus C where S equal to A plus B plus C by 2. So here uh, S is equal to S is equal to A plus B plus C by 2. So A is 5, B is 3, C is 4. That is 5 plus 3 plus 4. 5 plus 3 plus 4 by 2. 5 plus 3 is 8. 8 plus 4 is 12. 12 by 2. So 12 by 2 is 6. S is equal to 6. Therefore, area of triangle ABC. So just we have to substitute in the formula S into that is 6 into S minus A that is 6 minus A is 5. 6 minus 5 into S minus B that is 6 minus 3 into S minus C that is 6 minus 4. So just we have to simplify here square root of 6 into. So 6 minus 5 is 1. 6 minus 3 is 3. 6 minus 4 is 2. So square root of 6 into 1 into 3 into 2 also 6. Square root of 6 into 6 is 6 square units. 6 square units. So this is the area of the triangle with the given points using Heron's formula. So this is the fifth problem in exercise 7.3. There are totally 5 problems. We have completed all the 5 problems. So that's all today's class. We will meet in the next class with another problem. Thanks for watching.